I know that you know bibliometric analysis is, is obviously it is an objective if you like quantitative measure of something related to your research quality and quantity so it's obviously an attractive proposition but there are lots of limitations and um, one of the main limitations is something that I see actually perform quite a lot is people who are actually comparing citations and bibliometrics from one discipline to another I mean you just can't do that uh, different disciplines they publish in different ways they have citation rates which are radically different the turnaround times of articles are radically different you can't compare really one discipline to another very routinely and so that should be avoided. I think within disciplines is probably more straightforward though even in those circumstances um, applied areas it seems to me applied research areas even in our particular subject are most often dealt with in the context of special publications or um, or conference volumes and, and, and so they may not routinely be trawled by ISI and they obviously fare uh, I suppose less well uh, by conventional analysis of ISI. You could perform other types of analysis including Scopus or Google Scholar and so on but it's obviously get, getting much more difficult to perform those types of routine, it's not routine anymore and so um, that's, that's a difficulty particularly for those in applied research it seems to me. Um, there are other things which is like uh, really uh, any of these bibliometrics they make no account of of, of age and, and sort of potential you know so if you have somebody applying for a job and they're young I mean how can you simply perform a bibliometric analysis of their performance in the past when they've hardly been there you can of course read the papers and that's the best way of doing it I think when you get to old fuddy duddies like me it might be that there may be certain much greater value attached or uh, importance attached to maybe I suppose the body of work that they might have and, and the extent to which it's cited although again it needs to be moderated by I suppose proper sort of assessments by peers but it's still useful measure and it's obviously a complement to many others which uh, uh, on the scale certainly of schools and colleges um, it's something which which can help in the assessment and, and it can often be a friend to those departments who are doing well and faring well in research in, in the absence of uh, really uh, a detailed analysis uh, in other ways.